I might have just found the best way to make money online in 2025, and it involves travel. I just built a hotel booking site that competes with the biggest names in the business, gives you the best rates. I don't know how the hell they even do this, and it's a business in a box with a few clicks without writing a single line of code. And then I customized it to make it a super custom experience, throwing out the old traditional ways of booking hotels. This is vibe coding at its best. 80% of all bookings are done online. Travel is absolutely booming. In 2024, $9.5 trillion was spent on travel. And here's the kicker. Once you launch your actual website, which is 100% for free, you actually earn commissions on every single sale. This video was part one of a multi-part series because I'm actually launching my own website and you're gonna get to watch behind the scenes exactly on how I build my business, how I launch my business, how I market my business, and how you could literally replicate exactly what I do step by step. This isn't exclusive to the US. So if you're in France, if you're in Africa, this is worldwide. So if you've been looking for a no code opportunity, if you're stuck trying to just create demos and you don't actually have a real business, if you stick around, you're gonna have a full fledged booking business. All right, enough talking, enough chatter. Let's jump in. Give me 10 really fun ideas for a hotel booking website that has a search feature and you could type in different things into the search, like what movies have the most famous hotels or what are the top five places to see in 2025? Give me 20 really crazy ideas. Let's see what it comes up with. So this is the type of thing you're gonna be able to actually do now. That's gonna be custom. So the, the traditional way of booking a hotel we have but now we can actually build something on the front end using no code that's gonna make this experience so much more fun. How about this? So hotels from famous movies, Vibe Match Finder, show me hotels that feel like Coachella but in Italy, TikTok hotspots, where are people filming viral travel content right now, breakup recovery trips, I just got dumped, show me healing hotels in nature with zero kids. <laughs> that's amazing. So we're gonna introduce my idea which is where, why, when, where are you going? Why are you going? And when are you going? That's my idea. So let's do that now. So they made this really simple for people that don't know how to actually code to use the full code solution by creating this cookbook. This is a light API using node.js and it uses Git and NPM. So you can actually preview and build everything and it is plug and play. So this is what we're going to be using to actually build our new front facing website. Okay. So here's how you do it. You click on this example button. It's going to take you to the Git. and there's a couple ways about it. If you guys aren't familiar with Git, the easiest way is just go right here and click download zip. This will just download the file on your local computer. Or if you know what you're doing, just click and copy this link right here. Then we're going to go open up cursor. Now we're going to start building. So it's going to say, what do you want to do? I'm going to clone a repo. And that's the link that we're going to paste here. I'm going to hit go. Now it's going to ask me, where do you want to launch this project? So I'm just going to put it on my desktop, call a new one. We're going to call this. So the name of our website is Zello with three Z's. Book it with Zello, baby. Yeah, that's the idea. So we already have our logo and we're going to say, select a repository. And then would you like to open it? Yes. So now we have already a full blown website ready inside our cursor. It has everything that you need to actually launch this site. Update the API keys and you're good to go. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go in cursor and just say this. Can you install all the environments and dependencies needed to run this project? It's a node.js project. And now cursor is going to actually install everything we need in order to actually preview this. And just like that, you're going to be able to actually have your own front end. It's gonna do NPM install. So this is all standard stuff. If you guys haven't played around with cursor, there's a lot of tutorials out there, but right now all we need is this to get this running. So now it's been installed. So all you have to do is ask, can you run this locally? There's obviously commands for this, but I'm trying to keep this really simple for you guys. So there it is. And now we have our local host, which is here. So we're going to open this up onto our browser. And then you guys are going to see our website is live just like that. And this is actually connected. So this is a template that now uses you got your country, you got the city, you have your check-in dates, you have number of guests, and we're in a sandbox environment, as I showed you right here, we're in sandbox. And then we're gonna actually search our hotel. So if you do this right now and type in New York for, make sure you update the dates, cause it's 2024. 
So let's go 2025 and then hit search hotel. It's going to give us no results. You know why? Because we haven't actually put our API keys. So this is the next thing you guys have to set up in order to make this actually work properly. And if you already know this, you already know. So, right. But most people don't understand how this works. So you can see right here, we have this .env example file. So it says, make a new one called .env. So these are your environments. These are your passcodes. These are your keys to make sure that it works. So we're going to take that in. We're going to copy these. We're going to move them to the .env. And now we have it and we're going to take our keys. So this is the next step. Very, very important. We're going to go back to our website. Make sure you guys hit refresh. Make sure you're in sandbox mode. We're going to go into developer account, hit API keys. Then we have our production keys. So production private API key. We're going to copy that. We're going to go back to cursor and then we're going to do production API key right here. Don't bother copying them. I'm going to reset them after this video. So you guys won't be able to use it. And then we're going to go sandbox right here. Private key right there. Back to cursor. Sandbox key, copy paste, make sure you guys save the file and we should be good to go. So next we have to just run the server as you see right here. So now run NPM run start to actually run the server. So we're going to open up terminal and then we're going to copy that command and we are good to go. And again, you can just ask it to do it for you. So now we have our port, port 3000. We're going to go to our website, localhost 3000, and there is our site. And just like that, we have a full functioning project. It's obviously very simple, but the point is to first connect the APIs, make sure the API keys work, and then we're gonna get fancy. So let's go change the date to 25, so it's in the future. And then we're gonna hit search hotels. And just like that, bang! Guys, you have a full functioning travel site. It's crazy. This is real data right here. Look at this, city view, one queen bed in New York City. Let's change this to San Diego, where I'm at. This is so freaking exciting. Let's hit search hotel. It's looking and now we have everything in here, but here is the best part. Since we're connected to our white label solution, I can actually go in and test this in sandbox mode and you guys are going to see the booking right here. All right. So check this out. We're going to go back to the site and we're going to book this hotel right here. So now it says guest name. We're going to obviously do Marson AI email. So let's just do Marcin. And then voucher code is if you have a discount. So we're gonna hit book now. Now it's gonna take us to our payment page. Fully integrated. You don't have to do anything. This is like no code on steroids. You could literally build a full site in minutes. I mean, you saw me do it. You connect the APIs, you duplicate the project, and now you have a full functioning business. Like it's crazy. A, what is it called? A dummy credit card. So just type in 4242, and then just put anything in the future for expiration date. Let's go to 2026 zip code and just like that we are going to hit pay and we are booked and now we can actually customize it so you can go in and get as crazy as you want i'm going to show you what we can actually do but you have the rain right here this you have the freedom to do whatever you want now be able to make really fun search um, based booking sites can you stylize this website to make it a little more like a booking site okay our design is done so we're just going to reset the server and see how it looks. Let's go back to our website. So this is the old website. And now refresh the new site. Find your perfect stay. So you can see that it actually updated and gave me a new look. And we can continue developing on this. I don't want to spend an hour designing my site, but I want to show you the features so you could go on and do this yourself. So the one thing I want to do is connect the open API as we talked about. So set up your account. It's platform.openapi.com. Click over to API keys and you just create a new key here. We're going to call this Zello, which is our website. Create key. Don't bother copying this. I'm already going to delete it. Now we're going to say this. I want to now integrate the open API key. Here is the key. I want to have the ability to use open AI in my project. Okay. So now what it says, it gives you the directions. I want to just show you step by step. So first thing is open your .env file and add this in there. So we're going to go back to our project .env. We're going to copy this right here, copy, add a new line and paste that in there. And now you guys can see open AI API key is in here, hit save. And then here's the basic example, how to use open AI in the project. I want to add a search field where I could search for hotels based on what, where, and when I want you then to give me a really funny response with a lot of humor, pseudo trolling me on what my response is. I also want you to connect 
my search API results with the light API and show me relevant hotels based on my search inquiry. Do you understand my request? Make sure you ask that question, guys, so it doesn't just go off and hallucinate. Okay, check this out. So I understand your request. Here's a breakdown. Add a search field to your app when a user can enter what, where, and when. When the user submits a search, the app should call the Light API to fetch relevant hotels based on the search criteria. Before showing the real results, the app should display a funny pseudo trolling response about the user's search. Looking for a hotel in the middle of nowhere on a Tuesday, bold choice. After the joke, show the actual hotel results. Do you already have a hotel search endpoint set up with Light API or should I implement this from scratch? Let's add the search functions and see what API endpoints we need in order to make this work. There it is. All right, guys. So the first big customization of our website is creating an open AI search with some funny API responses, and then it's going to actually show us our results. I haven't done this yet. I'm doing this in real time because this is the idea for my website. And then we're going to skin it, make it look pretty, and we're going to launch it to production and actually launch this website. Okay, our final update is in. Let's do this. Las Vegas. Fun golf trip with the boys. Make sure it's close to a casino. Okay, let's do 25. 25. And hit search. And here we go. We're going to get our results. Oh, a fun golf trip to the boys to Vegas, huh? I see you've chosen a destination where focus on your golf swing might be a bit challenging. Thanks for the distraction nearby. There's our hotel, guys. This is all working. And of course, this is all actually using the open API and the light API. So if we go back in here to our website, we could now see, if we go to insights, you could actually see this website being live, even though we are in test phase. Look at this, 37 searches. So everything is being tracked in our environment without us having to do anything besides connect the white label solution, build out a fun cursor front end, and everything absolutely works with this template website that you could literally drag and drop as you see me set it up. And there's kind of three different ways to look at this, depending on your level of coding experience. Super easy, you guys could join for free. Just set up with your Gmail account and you get access to the actual platform. So let me just kind of run you through what you can actually do. But the most important thing is you could now build travel websites literally with a click of a button up to 2 million properties worldwide. So you get access to everything. So one is literally the no code, white label, business in a box opportunity. This is definitely a click set up, put your payment put your email address and you're good to go. You literally have a full functioning website like this one right here. This is a full site and this works. So let's check out San Diego. I'll just show you really quick. So this is this literally takes five minutes to set up. Let's go May 24th. You actually get listings that you can book. And these prices are guaranteed to be lower than most of the travel sites. You can go in here, you can see availability and you can actually book and you get paid on this. If somebody books on your site, this is my custom domain. So that's the first opportunity. The second opportunity is the low code opportunity, which is widgets. So you can go in, you can put a map widget onto your current website. Let's say you have a travel blog, or you just want to have this as a side project for any website, you could just embed it into your website. So this is kind of the low code. This is the easy one. You just log in and we're going to actually build the white label solution that is plug and play. So you get to your dashboard, you can see right here, you got bookings. This is all included in the white label solution for free. You don't have to do anything. You have your developer center, then you have your earnings. And if you switch to sandbox right here, you can see I already did my test payments to make sure all this works. But up here, you can see sandbox. So that's kind of development. And then you have production. So let's stay in sandbox mode. So you can see you got earnings, all your reports, you got your balance, your payouts, your payment method. Then you have your insights. This shows you everything about your customers. Once you get everything going, you have 21 searches to the website, which I launched today while I'm making this video. This is all fresh, guys. I'm actually going to launch a full blown business from this because how crazy this platform is. You can also do vouchers so you can do discount codes or special promotions. So let's actually go in and customize mine. The first thing you can do is your appearance. So I definitely kind of have this purple vibe that I've been going with, as you can see in my background here. Then you have your font. You can pick your fonts. You could pick the different things. You could change your icons. And then you have your hero um, image, the one that you can see right here. So this is kind of like the front end 
um, that you can actually change to make this look a little more custom to you for your white label solution. But again, this is zero code plug and play. There's also an abandoned checkout sequence that you can actually set up. It'll track all your emails. If people go to your website, but they don't purchase, you can then send them emails with promotion codes. As you can see, I already tested this. We got our first email that was clicked. It actually tells you if what your status is and also the recovery status. So this is really, really powerful. Once you have a live white label solution, now on top of this, you could start integrating the low code solution and also the full no code AI vibe coding solution. So let's jump into the second part of this, which is actually these widgets, okay? So this is what it'll look like. It'll just be a little widget that's on your website and this fully works. You can type in San Diego, you could put the date. So let's go May 21st, two people, you hit search and it'll give you your actual search on your white label website. How the heck do you get paid from this and how much can you get paid? So if you look down here, but down here, there's a thing called markup. This is what your commission is on your website. So right now, if you try to book on your site, the white label solution, you're guaranteed to get the lowest prices. I mean, most of the sites I've looked at compared to my website, my prices are the cheapest, which is kind of crazy. I don't even know how they do this, but they do. And then here's the best part. You could set your markup. So if you want to make 5% commission, it's going to lower the prices on your websites and then you're going to make 5%. But you could, for example, do 10%. So on every transaction. So if you somebody books a $1,000 website, you make 10%. You make a $100 commission. If you could set this to 20% if you want. So let's say you have like a viral post or a super popular blog and people trust you, you can make 20% on all your sales. So there's a way to actually move this needle based on what your needs are and how cheap you want to go, how high you want to go. So sky's the limit. You can play with this, but the point is you can adjust this. So I keep it at a standard 10%. This is one of the success stories from Light API. It's called Weno or Weno. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's a full blown app. Like, look at this. So it has all the maps. It's got all your everything that you want on your iPhone and you're able to actually book directly on this app using the API. So the one other thing I want to show you is a little bit more of the kind of technical side of this for people that are interested is there is a lot of stuff you can do with this API. So I'm just showing you the basics in this video, but the endpoints for this are kind of limitless. So the first thing you can do is you got the hotel data API. I showed you this, pull the hotels, the cities, the countries, the currencies, this is worldwide. So you can set this up for France if you live there. And then you have your search API. So this is actually going to search the room rates for your hotel stay. And then you have the booking, which is how to actually do the payment processing, making sure all that works. And then you have your loyalty API. So all of that has endpoints. So once you go in here, you could actually do all of this on your kind of vibe coded hotel front end. So it's not limited to what I just showed you. You could set up all the different endpoints, just tell cursor exactly what you're doing. And it's going to be able to do that based off of the API. And if you ever get stuck and something doesn't work, just copy this URL go into cursor and say, Hey, here is the documentation for the API endpoints. And it's going to be able to do it. And then you have a bunch of other stuff here that you could do with the API, super technical stuff. But if you don't know what to do, just put it into cursor, put it into chat GPT, and it will help you implement all of these. But I showed you the simplest, fastest way to do this. But if you want to get crazy and technical, there is definitely a solution for it and it's all possible. So sky's the limit. I can't wait to see what you guys create. Put it in the comment section, send me a link, definitely come join our community where we're going to have people in here building their own hotel websites. I think we're up to 4,952 members. It's been a blast. We got people in here just starting out no code to full stack developers building, creating, and now everybody in here is going to be able to actually make their own travel site, which is super exciting. This is full production. So what I just showed you right now within minutes, you could set up your white label. You could actually get the API keys and build out something really fun like we just did for our hotel to be able to do whatever your mind can come up with. Make sure you guys use ChatGPT for the fun, crazy ideas. And I'll see you in the next video. And definitely going to do a part two follow up for this because we are going to launch our website called Zello. This is going to be a blast. In the next video, I'm going to show you how we make these, how I'm going to be marketing this website. Me and my wife are actually going to partner up on this project together. And we're going to be making all kinds of different content and different front end websites using no code. Hope you guys enjoyed that and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.